Hey guys, what is up? Today we have a Primal Kyogre Collection box, I guess you could say. Um, I think a lot of this, um, not a lot of people are probably going to get this because of that hollow foil card in there. Just because it's probably, I mean it looks awesome, I, I have to say it looks awesome, but with that tin out and stuff like that, they are probably going to go for more of that, but I like it, I've already gotten the um, Primal Kyogre uh, uh, tin, so I, I think I've already opened on this channel. Pretty sure I did. Um, but anyway, we also get that figure inside, and also today we have two Primal Clash in here, a Phantom Force, and a Furious Fist, so hopefully, maybe we pull a little, you know, full arts. That'd be awesome. Uh, I already have the silver card in the Phantom Forces, but I'm not opposed to playing again. But really, what I'm looking for is in the Furious Fist, I'm looking for a Mega Lucario. Or something, or actually start with the Lucario EX, really doesn't matter because I obviously if I pull the Mega Lucario, I'm gonna need a Lucario EX, which I do not have. But I hope to pull something. I have the Mega um Mega Heracross, so a Heracross EX would not be out of the question either. Uh, so anyway, also we have a legendary treasures which I picked up, which I think I'll be doing each um one in each uh video because I want to pull this restaurant, well, as not this restaurant, but a restaurant full art in here, and it's a rosy restaurant. It has roses behind it, that's why I call it rosy restaurant. And I have yet to pull it. I've pulled two full art shamans and two full art Meloetta EXs, but I have not pulled that restaurant EX, there, um, the rosy restaurant EX that I want. And that has just eluded me. I know I could just buy it probably for, it's not that much, but I really just want to pull it. So, will be going uh, every time I open a pack you know or a box or something like this I will also add in a legendary treasures just to try to get that thing all right anyway let's go with the box opening all right kind of move that a little bit let's go okay see this box this box is nice this box opens so easily all right we have it out of the box now and that now it's gonna not gonna stand up all right let's put the box to the side as you see, we have everything here. I'll get it out and show you a close-up. We'll start with the hollow foil card, the um, promo card for this set, which is not a bad card or at all. You know, I'd, I'd have to say it's um, one of the better hollow foil cards that I've seen. God damn, this looks nice. All right, here I'll get. Uh, I'm gonna just get out of this this side of the way for now, just so I so I can show you a close-up on the card. That looks very nice, in my opinion. If you can see the Kyogre, and then you can see the background, that gold color, it looks like a pretty damn nice gold color. I mean, I'm guessing they were trying to do something like a C kind of thing, and they did a terrific job on this. So I think, if anything, I think I might throw this into one of my decks, because this, this is really good. I'll just, uh, as you know, all promo cards kind of come uh, um, bent a little bit, you know? You see this, like, curve and stuff like that, but that can be uh, taken out with the top loader, I'm pretty sure I've heard. And I picked one up at uh, Dunham Sports, actually, for, um, I think, $2.99. So, they're not that much, and you get, like, about, um, actually, I have them right here. You get uh, 35 top loaders, uh, Ultra Pro top loaders, for $2.99. That's where I picked it up, Dunham Sports and stuff. So, we're going to, I'll put that in there later, but we're going to set that off to the side for now. Here we go, I'm going to... Adjust the camera a little bit, sorry about that. And let's pull out that awesome looking figure. Ooh, this guy looks nice. Check out that guy. If I can get this to focus on him. You can see what it um, looks like. It's kind of focusing on the ghost picture behind it, so... Try to get that focused in or something like that. But check out that guy. That is an awesome figure right there. Yeah, that is nice. I wish he would focus in, but I don't think he's gonna. Alright, anyway. Figure uh, is there. That's an awesome figure. But, let's get on to what I'm really looking forward to in this collection, in this uh, box opening. And, of course, that would be the packs. Whoa! Dropped a pack. Sorry about that, guys. Alright. Let's get this going. We'll start with Primal Clash. And, I really, sometimes I like to go oldest to newest, but I want to try to save the potential older cards like um, Mega Lucario EX and maybe a silver card again. I mean, I know I've pulled, if you see one of my uh, my Groudon tin 
I pulled a silver Dialga out of that. If you want to go see that, you can. Uh, I don't have too many videos up right now, so it should be easy to find. It's just a Groudon tin. I, I re-uploaded it from my first channel, so it shouldn't be that hard to find. But anyway, let's get the Primal Clash, and maybe, just maybe, we can pull a Full Art Primal Kyogre or Primal Gr Full Art Primal Ground, because that is still the ones I am looking for right now, because I have not pulled a Full Art Groudon or a Full Art Kyogre or anything like that, so... So I really want that. Even a regular one would be fine. Alright, so put the code card off to the side. We go one, two, three. Put that to the front. Alright. Let's get this on then. All right, if I can get that focused on this. The focusing on my camera is not that well good well good, you know, so but I think it does a decent job at least, so to show you at least the card and stuff like that, so let's go. Sometime later I'll probably um, do it and stuff like that where it's better and stuff, but this is a trick I learned or something like that. Apparently you gotta get it in close so it focuses or something like that, and it's not working, so we'll pull it out and just do this. Alright, first card, we have a Vibrava, a Lanoon, Spirit Link, or Kyogre Spirit Link. And that might be, well, I have a lot of those, so it doesn't really matter, so I can do that anytime. Alright, we have a, I'm going to move this around so you can see it it's better a little bit. A horsey in there, to size focus. A chin chow. A tynamo. A nidoran. A reverse pro a reverse hollow pro pass, which I have a lot of. And the rare of the pack is a wall rain. Rare non-hollow, looks like. Ah. Oh. That's a little disappointing. All right, on to the next Primal Clash. We have two Primal Clash, one Phantom Force, and one uh, Fierce Fist, and also the Legendary Treasure at the end, which I'll open. But for now, let's get on to the next Primal Clash. All right, I'm gonna move these over here for now, onto the side, I'm talking about the cards you can't see. All right, let's put this off to the side, the code card. And we go one, two, three, and to the top, or to the front, not the top, uh, alright. Here we go, let's focus that. Alright, we'll start out with a Masquerain, an Acro Bike, a Lombre, Hippopotas, Slugma, Nidoran, uh, boy or girl? Girl, okay, I, I'm not sure if there's, I forget the differences and stuff. Alright, we have a Trampinch, a Sfeel, a Reverse Clam Pearl, and the rare of the pack is a half Art Needle Queen, non-hollow rare. Alright, not bad. half Art Needle Queen's not bad. I haven't really used it, but I'll just start using it sometime because I want to... It's not that bad. The Ancient Trades, I, I really want to try, and I've never really... I don't think I've actually tried a Ancient Trades in my deck and stuff like that. I don't know if you guys are just collectors or something like that, or if you actually play the game, but I like the... Um, I don't usually, uh, I, I've seen the abilities of half arts and stuff like that, but I haven't really used any, so I've really got to get some, uh, try and do that and stuff like that, put some half arts, play with them a little bit. Alright, anyway, let's go with this, the Phantom Force, we'll go one, two, three, potential Silver Dialga in here, of course. So let's try it. Alright. Start with this. We have a Fletchinder, or Fletchinder, I don't know. Roller Skates. Uh, Dimension Valley, not sure about that one. A Swirlix. A Litwick. Yanma. Spiro, old card there. <laughs> old Canto card, so let's go Krabby. A Reverse Lampent. And the rare of the pack is a Levani. Uh, non hollow man, we are not getting good with really any cards. I mean, the half art was fine, but I pulled a lot of half arts, so like that hopefully, 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 we're sitting with a you know, some full art card in the Furious Fist set, or at least an EX. That would be fine with me. That would be fine with me. All right, let's go put the card to the side. One, two, three, let's put that to the front. Alright, let's focus on that then, 
if we can. Come on, focus on the combustion. If we can, okay, it'll focus later, I'm sure. All right, anyway, let's start. We have combustion. Lucky, lucky. Clef key. Gotharita. I wish this would focus. Come on. All right, focus on that, so it should be able to. There we go. All right, we have an Electabuzz, an Eevee, Glaferi, Plusle, a Reverse Hitmon Lee, and that is nice because I actually I think I just traded one of my Hitmon Lees away, so uh, I think it was Hitmon Lee or was Hitmon Top. Now, anyway, yeah, I like Reverse Hitmon Lee. So, and the rare of the pack is a Bloom. Non hollow rare. That's great. Awesome. Nothing in those, so I'm really, really hoping we at least pull a full art in the legendary treasures. I'd say this one is over, but well the box is over, but we still have the legendary treasures without which I will open for that potential rosy restaurant. Alright. Get that out. And as you see we have Legendary Treasures has a Mewtwo on it. I was hoping the outside of the pack had a restaurant, so I'm thinking, oh, maybe it, maybe it has something in it. Maybe it has a restaurant in it, but... Alright, now I'm not sure on how to do these, because the Legendary Treasure set is apparently different on how the rares and the hollows work, so I'm going to try doing this, let's see, one, two, three, or no, one, two, I think it's one, two, then one, two, and then like that or something like that I, I'm not sure so we may pull a uh, pull the rare faster or something like that I'm hoping we grab a full art or something all right anyway let's get this focused in all right it's focused in there should focus on this now all right start out Mencino a Ralts Tepig Tangela Reverse Water. Okay, so this is not how I do this. Alright. Fioni. I think that's non hollow or something like that. Cheruby. Energy Switch. The Purloin. And a Teddy Ursa. Super disappointing. Alright. Super disappointing pulls, guys. What is up? Okay. I don't understand this. This was. This was very disappointing box and a legendary treasure thing. God dang. Alright, that's sucky. Alright, anyway, I feel like I gave away a code one time, or one thing, so I'm going to give away um, on my on my last thing, so I I think I'll give away one of the Primal Clash booster, or booster packs that I got, you know, or I mean give away a code for the online, it's not what I mean, like not give a physical one away because I can't do that, I can't afford that, but um, I'll give a code, so the code will be right here, guys. So, if you take that and get it, uh, tell me what you got online, and uh, if it's anything good, probably better than I got in this poll. I mean, I usually get better stuff online. I have, like, really good stuff online. So, tell me what you got, uh, and yeah, <laughs> that was very disappointing. Sorry, guys, I'm so disappointed right now in that box, but yeah, so tell me what you think, if you like it. Uh, Probably go check out one of my other videos because they are way better than this one. I actually pull EXs and stuff like that, but and the silver Dialga card from that one. So I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in another video.